Yes, there's a coalition of men's good customers is calling for the arrest of Chief Executive Officer of Gold Dealership, Nana Apia Mensa. This follows a recent announcement by the men's good CEO claiming to have paid affected customers to the tune of 9.6 billion million cities. He further uh, pledged the company uh, is committed to uh, settling about 60 million in total by the end of 2020. But coalition of agreed customers of men's gold described the claim as a fallacy. Put on record that that le the letter caption to whom it may concern, full of falsehood and another demonstration of the criminality on the part of men's good leadership. One, the issue about 9.6 million Ghana cities having been paid to customers is false. And two, it demonstrates criminality. Why are we saying that? One, men's gold accounts were frozen by Iyoko by a court order. And when he came from his hideout, from wherever he went in Europe or the Americas, he told the world that his account has been frozen and he begged the government to unfreeze the account. We have not heard that those accounts were, have been, was unfreeze or whatever. So we do not know when he had money to pay the 9.6 million. From which account did he pay those monies? Fred, but you agree with me that he had a pending case in, in Dubai of which he was demanding a certain amount of money and that money may have come and probably that's, and we know that we, from what we've heard that he won that case, if indeed he won the case then the money is in. We have also heard that from our source that that money is in. If that money is in, that money belongs to men's gold customers and it should be properly handled. That is why we are calling on the government to arrest Namwon immediately confiscate all the assets and the bank accounts or whatever, and government should take over the payment. If government leaves payment to Nam one, if government says that Nam one should deal with his customers, he will bring another payboy. Recently he brought payboy. The next time, he, we don't know the pay, whatever he will bring. Yeah, but I was even going to ask you, the pay boy that was brought on board recently, is it the same as the old pay boy or is it a different pay boy? What we knew was the old payboy that, that was demanding 9%, 20%, and 30% from customers from the already locked up investment. Per Iyoko's arrest on 27th May 2020, and the letter that was released by payboy itself, that company, that scheme was a scam. And as we speak, it, we were told that no less than 500 people were trapped into that one, that their monies are also locked up. So we have second victims from Nam one. And so Nam one claiming to have paid 9.6, it's a fallacy, total fallacy. This must not happen in this current generation. It is very bad. It sends a bad signal to the people who are to enforce our laws. That is why we are calling on the president, the chairman of the national security, to order immediate arrest of Nam one and also pay our locked up investment from the consolidated fund. Why should government go into the consolidated fund to, 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 to pay your locked up fund? Because we have sat down and, and done some analysis, analysis and uh, some observation. Government shut down men's good, one. Government shut down savings and loan scheme. Both of them, government said that they have flouted the rules, the law, okay. The government takes a political decision. I'm not looking at partisan. I'm looking at policy decision that I'm going to pay the customers of these collapsed banks and the savings and loan scheme. Then, and government did not tell them to go chase after the directors of those savings and loan schemes. Then now the same government, which collapsed men's good, because I've demonstrated to you that whether you are licensed or not is immaterial before the law, say that go after number one. I mean, we think that is unfair. And if this country, we, our motto is, freedom and justice, then I believe that we must also be treated justly. And that money should come from the, consolidated, come from fund. the consolidated fund.